Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to Haley's Comments. I'm so excited for this video today because it is a collab with ADHD Dude. So ADHD Dude is another ADHD YouTuber. I just love finding ADHD YouTubers. He is super cool. He's only been posting videos for like the last few months. So he's a very new YouTuber. And so you guys need to go give him some love, check him out because he makes awesome videos. He just hasn't been doing it for very long. So we need to help him go check out his channel. For today's video, we switched hyperfixations. If you guys don't know, people with ADHD hyperfixate on certain things. Some hyperfixations are long-term. Some are something that just last for like a day or like a few weeks. We told each other what our hyperfixations were at the time and then we did each other's. And it's been interesting because I kind of picked up a new hobby that I didn't have before. When you have a hyperfixation, it's something that you always wanna be doing and it's something that you're kind of obsessed with. You always wanna talk about it. You always wanna do it. You're always thinking about it. It is kind of cool to see what someone else's hyperfixation is because I feel like it can just really show you that person and like what they're actually like. If you guys are new here, my name's Haley. I make ADHD related videos and other sorts of mental health videos on top of everything mukbang cbd reviews and just other random stuff that i want to do so if that sounds interesting please go ahead and subscribe all right let's get on into the video what's up guys so it is day one and it's nighttime already i have procrastinated so much drawing is not something i enjoy doing so it seems kind of intimidating so i've been kind of putting it off but i need to start it because the day is about to end i guess i'll plan my day for tomorrow with the bullet journal while listening to the music so basically i'm just gonna look up aesthetic bullet journal ideas and then we'll see what I come up with. I don't have really any art supplies, but I got some highlighters and a few pens. Have you been writing those letters to yourself? Dear Evan Hansen. It sounds like a commercial. Okay, here's why. We're not giving up before we've tried this year. Wait, I know this song! That wasn't even planned. <laughs> is it weird to say I think I heard the song from TikTok? Anyway, this music is interesting. It makes me really wonder what the hell this musical is about because there's some interesting lyrics. I'll show you what I've made so far. Yeah, I know it looks like shit. Okay, I'm trying. I'm trying to go for that rainbow aim aesthetic vibe, you know? I even have inspiration pulled up on my screen. I literally just can't draw. Well, this is the final project. That looks terrible. Looked way cooler in my head before I drew it. As does this. I was going for that AOL vibe, you know? But it looks terrible so that's how that went in terms of the music it's not bad i haven't seen the musical so i have no context of like what's happening it sounds good it sounds pretty i just feel like all musicals sound like all other musicals i've ever seen in my life but that's just my opinion so don't come for me we'll see how tomorrow goes i'll try to pick something easier to do so that it looks less sh What's up guys? It is day two, so I've got the music pulled up. I've got my bullet journal ready to go. I'm gonna try and do something a lot easier today because, well, we all saw how yesterday went, so... <laughs> So I was trying to go for like a vibe, which first off looks f terrible, but I wrote the wrong date. <laughs> okay, so this is my finished product for today. That's a huge improvement from yesterday. I mean, let's look back at yesterday's. Actually, yesterday's, I feel like, okay, maybe yesterday's was better. It's the big letters. Those big letters, dude, I just cannot do well. The cursive looks okay. I should do cursive next time. 
I tried. So on Thursday, I was actually overnight babysitting, so I wasn't able to talk in this video. Everything went the same as it did all the other nights. I was just in a different location. If you can hear any snoring in the background, it's because they had a really freaking cute dog. Oh my gosh, this dog was huge, probably like 115 pounds, and he only walked backward. Imagine a giant dog walking backward. <laughs> That was the funniest fucking sh- Here's proof I listened to the music and here's how it looked. I am back. I can talk this time. <laughs> I felt really weird doing it at their house because I couldn't talk, but anyway. So this music has grown on me for sure. And I'm I'm kind of excited to listen to it again. My boyfriend's staring at me. Uh, <laughs> I feel like the more you hear something, the more you like it. That's definitely happened to me with these musical songs. I've also liked drawing too, but it's coming out terrible. So it's also kind of frustrating. I can see the value in wanting to plan out your day the night before and like be creative, kind of wind down for the night while also looking forward to the next day. Like I could see why someone would want to do a bullet journal. Oh, hello. I have the cutest dog ever. I, oh my goodness. I just don't feel like it's necessarily for me, but it's probably for Ayn, right? Yeah. <laughs> He's like, why? based on the lyrics of these songs that I've been listening to over and over so they're like in my head. I feel like I know what this musical is about. Again, I've never seen it, but I feel like it's about, I don't know, I guess two gay guys who got some like scholarship or something and like got to go into acting school or something and like all of their acting dreams were coming true. And there's like some girl in his class or like some girl from his hometown who knows him and she's kind of salty about it and he's acting like everything's going great, but really like inside he's feeling like a failure and he's having like internal issues but he's like not projecting that to the world so he's really like holding himself in and the issues would be probably maybe like about his sexuality like he's still in the closet or something here is the finished product i'm actually pretty happy with it today i feel like it looks way better than it did all the other times these are stuff i'm gonna fill out tomorrow it's so cute i'm impressed with myself that looks so much better than freaking oh god I am tired, I'm gonna go to bed. I'm really sick of this music though. I was kind of starting to like it and now I'm just annoyed with it, so. Hey guys, so it's the next morning. I'm going to be doing it in the morning this time for a few reasons. Number one, because if I didn't, I wouldn't be able to finish this video on time. And number two, because a lot of times when you have a hyperfixation, the first thing you wanna do whenever you wake up in the morning is that thing. You don't wanna do anything else. You wanna do it all day long. The minute you wake up till the minute you go to bed, like you wanna be doing that thing. So I thought it was kind of accurate to do it in the morning. This is kind of a weird one to do in the morning though, I feel like, because usually I feel like people plan their days the night before. So I'm gonna be kind of planning my schedule for tomorrow without actually knowing what I'm getting done today, but we're just gonna ignore that. Maybe I'll just not put in any of the words of what I need to do tomorrow. Can you tell this is my morning voice? <laughs> and then I'll just decorate it and then I can put in the words later on or something. <laughs> in this musical that bothers the crap out of me is like sing and then like cut themselves off i don't know how to describe that but let me just show it to you we walk a while and talk about the things we'll do when we get out of I don't know, that's just really annoying to me. Well, here's the finished product. It kind of looks terrible, but I'm gonna put in a bunch of random, well, not random, but things I need to get done in here. Hopefully that ends up looking better. The cursive on the side looks like sh but okay. I didn't wanna be boring and do another one like this. I wanted to do something more creative, but clearly I just am not good at drawing or anything related to it. <laughs> But I tried. Thank you so much for watching. Please go check out ADHD Dude. For real, you guys need to. And check out the video that he did with my hyperfixation so you can see what I've been fixating on. All right, thank you so much for watching. I'll see you on Tuesday. Bye.
I have not been able to get that song out of my head. The freaking Requiem song. All we see is good for forever. Wait, that's the wrong song. That one's in my head too, apparently. I will 